A Saratoga woman using her photography skills to overcome adversity. Anne Marie Tan has been in four car crashes, each time suffering a traumatic brain injury. News 10 ABC's Harrison Giro caught up with the woman behind the camera to see how she's gotten used to what she calls the new Anne Marie. My camera has been my third kidney basically since high school, and it's been my way I've documented uh, through my life. Anne Marie Todd had her camera at her hip through all four crashes. Much like her photos, her injuries are sadly everlasting. I haven't recovered from the brain injuries. They're permanent. It's more of a matter of my being uh, aware of them and uh, knowing what the symptoms are and working around them, working with them. Todd saying when she first got hurt, no one had any idea. Uh, it wasn't even um, a medical label or a diagnosis at the time. It was much later that it was diagnosed. In 2002, um, it opened up an entirely brand new world for me. And so after a course of a bunch of years of getting uh, acclimated into it, I started to uh, photo document. Her years of hard work paying off this morning. Karen Thomas, Director of Family Services for the Brain Injury Association of New York, presented Todd with the Silent Angel Award, saying her positive attitude is what makes her so special. When you see Anne Marie Todd, it's rare that she's without a big smile. <laughs> and her camera is a talented angel and dedicated member of the association. But to anyone she meets, she becomes a cares friend. For Todd, even events like these can be a lot to handle, but she's found the perfect way to keep pushing forward. I'm having to wear my or wear my earplugs when the, the um, in crowds like this because the sound is like a freight train on a loop, and I'm overwhelmed by it. However, with my camera, when I have that focus, uh, I'm in my element. Reporting in Saratoga Springs, Harrison Duro, News 10, ABC. All right, Harrison, thank you. And you can see more of Anne Marie's photos over on our website, News10.com.